Hello everybody and welcome to my Hanukkah special. Today we're going to make a real treat for Hanukkah, latkes or potato pancakes. So come on with me and let's do this up. Okay, so I texted my mom early this morning and asked her to give me the recipe again to make latkes and um, what she did. And so you need three potatoes. So I've got three russet potatoes and we're just gonna start by uh, peeling the skins off of them, okay? So peel, peel, peel away. Okay, now that we've got the peeling done, we can take our potato peels and just throw those away because we're not gonna be using those. We've got our peeled potatoes. So basically we're just gonna take a grater and we're just going to break the potatoes into a nice little pile on a plate. Now this is a wonderful way to let out any aggression that you might have inside. Just great, 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 great. Grind those teeth. Just watch your fingers though while you're doing this. Okay, so now that our potatoes have been shredded and some of the moisture taken out, we're gonna take those, I'm gonna use a food processor because I'm gonna mash this up even finer this time because I'm gonna try to do something a little different by making them a little more or less coarse in texture. So we put our potato into there. Then we're gonna add one egg. So one egg to the hot. We're going to add um, one third of a cup of chopped up onion. So it's gonna give it some amazing flavor. So put that in there. We're also gonna add one clove of garlic. And so I'm going to quickly just mince that up a bit. Get chopped up more in the food processor, so add in some garlic. Some salt and pepper. So maybe we've got a good teaspoon of salt in there. Now if you have white pepper, that's what I would use. And I do have white pepper, so we'll just use a little bit of white pepper in there and half a cup of flour. So we're just gonna add in our flour. Put that all around. Put our lid on. And mix this up. Now I almost forgot my mom's secret ingredients which you will all be privy to, and that's just a dash of nutmeg. So we're gonna add just a little bit of nutmeg to this. And this is really turning into a nice creamy mixture. So this is gonna cook really well. So just give that one more little mix with the nutmeg. Okay, so our batter is ready and it's turned out really, really nice. This is gonna cook really, really well. And so I'm just heating up a frying pan here with about two tablespoons of olive oil into the pan. Just sort of get that around here. Ooh, it heats up pretty quick. And we're gonna cook up our latkes, brown them up on each side, and then I've just warmed up my stove to 325 degrees, and all the cooked latkes we'll just put into the stove to keep them warm, and um, go from there. So let's start with our first latka. Okay, so here we go. This is latka number one, so just take a good, generous amount sort of make that into a little pancake. Look 
Okay, and we're just gonna let that cook and brown up, just kind of like a regular pancake. You'll start to see little, little bubbles and holes forming on the top. Um, traditionally, these are served with either applesauce or sour cream. We always had them growing up with sour cream. And um, my mom would also fry up some bacon into little pieces and put that on top, which is really, really good. But, um, you know, obviously we can't have pork if this is going to be kind of a kosher thing. So, uh, but, you know, Rabbi Stern, who was my prof in university, a blessed memory, used to always say to me, Mark, there are many, many, many commandments that the Jewish people must follow. But there's always a loophole. you got to look for the loophole. And so, turkey bacon will work just fine, I think. So we're going to chop some of that up uh, and have that on the side. So just check on our pancake here. I think we're ready to flip over. Perfect. Okay, I think our latke number one is ready. So we'll put that off to the side. Actually, I'm just going to put this into the stove. Keep that warm and just sort of kind of keep cooking it through. And we're gonna make our second one. Oops. Okay, so I got my last latka cooking. So now let's chop up some of this turkey bacon just into little pieces. I'm just gonna fry that up and put that on top of our latkes. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're frying up our turkey bacon. And one of the games that is normally played during Hanukkah is dreidel. And there are Hebrew letters uh, on all the corners of the dreidel. And each of them means something like uh, you've got to put money in or you get to take the whole pot or whatever. But anyway, you're supposed to like spin the dreidel and then where it lands, that's what you, it's a game. It happens, it's fun. Wow, this turkey bacon actually even smells like regular bacon. But what you wanna do is get it to like little crispy crunchies. They're gonna be so good on top of your latkes. Okay, I think my turkey bacon's nice and crispy. I'm just gonna chop it up even finer now. Just let it cool a little bit. So. so I'm just gonna kinda just like I said, get it into like little, little crunchies. Bacon bliss. Like turkey bacon, not pork bacon, turkey. Okay, here we go. Let's take our latkes out of the stove. Wow, these smell so good. Look at that, they're perfect, absolutely perfect. Okay, and let's grab a plate. And so let's just take a couple of these here. Take two latkes. So we got two latkes on our plate. And so like I said, there's different ways of doing this. Traditionally, it's served with an applesauce. So I'm just gonna put a little of applesauce next to one of them here. And then the other one, I'm gonna put some sour cream with a little bit of our chopped up turkey bacon on top. And there we have it. Okay, I don't know how hungry you are, but I am. So let's try these. Hanukkah made vodka. So we're gonna try a little bit here with the applesauce first. Wow, that just, oh man, that looks so good. Mmm, 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 mmm. Oh my God, 
Those are so good. Oh, I love doing it in the food processor. It gets it to nice, almost like a silky smooth consistency. Now, with the sour cream and the turkey bacon. Mm. <laughs> mm. Oh, wow. Oh, my dad would love that one. Okay, happy Hanukkah. Thanks for joining me. Bye.